I'm gonna hide this tape when I'm finished. If nobody makes it, at least we'll have some kind of record. The storm's been hitting hard now for 48 hours. We still have nothing to go by. One other thing. I think it rips through your clothes when it takes you over. Windows found a set of shredded long johns, but the, but the name tag was missing. It could have been anyone's. Nobody, nobody trusts anyone anymore now. And we're all very, very tired. There's nothing more I can do but wait. CJ Thief, master movie poster, toy, concert memorabilia, collector, U.S. Outpost, 69.9. Signing off. Welcome to Thieves Theater. This is Thieves Theater, starring CJ Fee. Well, hello, YouTube, and welcome back to Season 3 of Thieves Theater. Remember to subscribe below, ring that notification bell, and comment. I'd really love to hear what you have to say. This episode is related to one of the most famous science fiction movies of all time, The Thing. And what I want to show you first is this little beauty right here. Got this early on when I started collecting movie posters and I got a great deal on this thing the 1951 original thing movie poster directed by Howard Hawks how did it get here astounding movie the thing just check this poster out so creepy it's got the kind of skin on the thing font from another world all the snippets from the movie Funny thing, James Arnez, who is very, very famous for the situational drama that was on CBS for many years in Gunspoke, was the alien monster in this movie. And this created the science fiction craze of the 50s. Was this movie poster and movie came out in 1951. So let's check that out. That's 71 years, 71 years ago. Just check that poster out. Isn't that great shape, Chase? Wow, look wow, at it. Wow, look at it, Just it's, it's a beauty. Directed by Howard Hawks. Unbelievable stuff right here. Anyone messes with me and the whole camp goes. Now check out the 1982 movie poster for John Carpenter's The Thing. And here it is, in all of its glory. Such a fine movie poster. Uh, the ultimate in alien terror, John Carpenter's The Thing. Black background, white border, mostly blue, black, and gleaming white. You don't know anything about the monster in this movie but let me tell you the thing over the years has become probably one of the top three monster movies of all time John Carpenter's a thing now let's check out the 2011 movie poster also called the thing from the producers of Dawn of the Dead it's not human yet but check this bad boy out Chase he's got the alien hand can't really see his face. His mouth is wide open right here. He's got his parka on. But this movie was the first story of The Thing, but they shot it backwards. So The Thing from 1982 was the first movie that was released, but this was the information on 
on the thing. The prequel. The prequel, yes. Look at these look at yes. these hands here. Wait yes. a second. Isn't that a cool hand? So he's in the beginning of his metamorphosis and both movies are very, very excellent. You have to check them out. Now, let's go over here and check out the toys. Now, I gotta tell you, I can't believe that it's been 22 years since these two toys came out. Part of the Movie Maniacs 3 line produced by McFarland Toys, and I think of all the toys in their entire realm of Movie Maniacs, these two have to be in the top 10 because they are the most detailed, and of course, this is from one of the most famous science fiction horror movies of all time. So on my right, we have the Blair Monster, and just check out the Blair Monster, how detailed it is, backdrop, of the movie poster with a very very creepy frame and just check out the detail look you got the dog coming out over here you got these slimy appendages coming out I could just hear it Unbelievable detail has to be in my top five of all McFarlane's toys and over here on my left Check out the Norris creature with spider Wow, we look at the detail on this you got hair over here and This is from one of the creepiest scenes of all time in any science fiction movie uh, when they were defibrillating Mr. Norris on the table and I can just remember how the belly opened up and the jaws bit off the doc's hands and then this mayhem started in the operating room. Oh my goodness. And the spider evolved. All of a sudden the spider evolved and it starts scurrying on the ground and no one knows it until Mac McCready picks up the flamethrower and burns the spider. <laughs> and like I say, I want to reiterate, these two, po these two toys right here, probably in my top five of all the toys that I have because of the detail and the subject matter, and of course, the movie. The Thing, 1982, by John Carpenter. So folks, I haven't been collecting toys in quite some time, but in 2021, when Real Toys NECA produced these two toys in front of me from the 1982 movie The Thing starring Kurt Russell, I had to have them because they fit right into this episode and they are really, really detailed toys. Check it out on my right. The Thing Ultimate McCready Station Survival. Wow. Beautiful artwork on the cover. Let's open it up. Bang. Look at this toy. Kurt Russell in the middle. Beautiful likeness. You got seven interchangeable hands. You got the flamethrower. You got the dynamite. Look, you got another head you can put on him. Fire. What are these here, Chase? I can't see from here, but they look pretty damn cool. They're very small. What do they look like to you? Uh, what is that? Uh, what is that? It might be goggles. I don't know. He's got his, uh, you know, olive-colored fatigues on, the snow boots. Look at the leather jacket. It's so famous. Big wooly beard, shaggy hair. Kurt Russell outdid himself in this movie. Beautiful packaging on this one. I'll just spin it around real quick for you. Side, beautiful artwork. Look at the back. You can see how you can pose him. Oh, he also has the, um, when he had the Petri dish and the blood jumped out. Check it out oh, right there, yeah. Chase. That's what that bugger is. 
unbelievable detail on this toy, the Ultimate Kurt McCready Station Survival. Check this one out. Very, very sim similar box set, but this is the movie poster artwork. And this is the Ultimate McCready Outpost 31 box set by Real Toys and NECA. Let's open it up. Got a beautiful fold out. And there he is, Kurt Russell. He's got two interchangeable heads. The floppy hat, which looked so corny back then, but let me tell you something, that hat is so cool. And down at the bottom, you have his uh, scotch, his scotch glass. Remember that scene in the movie when he's playing chess and he gets perturbed because the computer beats him and he dumps the, the glass of scotch into the machine. And Wow, lantern, shotgun, still has the snow boots on, the olive fatigues, and look at that leather jacket, shaggy hair and beard. This is the Ultimate McCready Outpost 31. Check it out. We're going to close the box, spin it around. Antarctica. This box is so shiny. It's so... Very, very shiny, yeah. isn't it? It's got like a silvery tint to it showing different ways you can dress him up and there he is drinking the scotch NECA really did a great job on these toys NECA real toys ultimate McCready station survival and ultimate McCready outpost 31 toys great stuff right here <laughs> I'm, I'm so lucky to have this final piece of my collectibles, the Ennio Marconi soundtrack. So famous now. The soundtrack for the thing. And when you put this music on, there is no mistaking that this music is from the 1982 classic, John Carpenter's The Thing. And this I got from a store, but as you can see on the top, it's for a promotion only. Check out the album cover, stark black background with The Thing in bold white, composed and conducted by Ennio Marconi. Man is the warmest place to hide. <laughs> oh my God, that's great. Check out the back and you have some snippets from the movie. And here are the titles of the songs. And there you have information on the movie such a very very cool thing to have in my collection ladies and gentlemen i have to tell you i've had such a great time tonight sharing with you all of you my thing collectibles and uh, not too many but the ones that we have are premium and really really cool some of the episodes coming out in season three are just spectacular and i and i really owe it all to my producer director son chase he does such a phenomenal job. And uh, come on back. Spend some time with us. Because I enjoy doing these videos. I am CJ Thee. Signing off.